It was breaking my whole heart. Caitlin Bristow is seeking sole custody of her pups. After the former Bachelorette star and ex Jason Tardik agreed to split custody of their golden retrievers Ramen and Pino following their August 2023 split, she's detailing why the setup is no longer working for her or the pups, explaining on the September 19th episode of her Off the Vine podcast. I think everyone knows, especially if you listen to the podcast or follow me at all, you know how important Ramen and Pino are to me. They are legitimately the light of my life and it kills me. I know I travel a lot. It kills me to leave them. And the 39 year old reveals that her golden retrievers have not been keen on being passed between her and Jason's home. What I realized in sharing custody with the dogs is that they get very scared and very uncomfortable and very anxious, not knowing where they're going and when they're coming back. This is not personal to anybody. It happened when they are at one house. It happens when they're in my house. They get scared to leave. I just noticed some really big shifts in them with anxiousness and it was breaking my whole heart. Caitlin also details being reprimanded for the joint custody setup she and Jason had in place after reaching out to the adoption agency she rescued the pups from. And when I talked to Bunny's buddies, which is where I rescued them both from, they were like, this is not allowed. We would not let somebody rescue these two angel dogs who need security, who need love, who need stability to be bouncing around in a joint custody. We would have never, you know, like I, th I think they even said that they could take the dogs back if they felt that it wasn't fair to them. And while Caitlin, who notes it was in the dog adoption contract to not do joint custody, ultimately decided to keep the pets permanently in her care. She emphasizes that Jason will still have as much of a relationship with them as he wants, emphasizing her openness to her ex seeing the dogs came from a negative past experience. Even though I am aligned with the contract with them not bouncing around, I would never keep them from somebody. I just want to make it clear that he is more than welcome to see them if he is in town for the weekend or wants to take them for a walk. I would never keep them from anyone. I will never forget, and I'm not going to name names, an ex said to me, you'll never see this dog again. And it broke my soul to not see this dog again. And I remember saying I would never do that to anybody.